Hello everybody. I wanted to make this updated video because it seems more personal. And after two weeks away from school and everything that has changed in that time and that will continue to change, a little more personal is nice. I hope you're all doing well. This has been a strange, strange time. And my family and I are, like you, taking things day by day. We had a restful break, mostly hanging around the house and going for neighborhood walks and on hiking trails, ensuring that we're following social distancing. My kids and I have decided to learn a couple of songs by the Arkells and record them. I've been mixing an album from my friend's band and practicing my guitar. Having something to do while you're cooped up helps, uh, helps us to alleviate some of the friction that can be inevitable in families in close quarters. Some of our guided reading groups have been reading about Anne Frank. Little did we realize that we would all be having a taste, albeit a very small taste, of what that must have been like. We will get through these unusual circumstances, but know this, nobody has the answers to much right now. As the situation changes from day to day, we're all just trying to find our way and work towards making things work. Please don't feel like you have to have all the answers to everything. Our education is certainly no exception. Principals and teachers have begun the process of figuring out a couple of common platforms and we'll spend the next week trying to see how that will fit in with our families and our schools and our classes. Students in our class have already become at least somewhat familiar with a platform called The Hub. Uh, they've created personal profiles for their blog, which will be starting up very soon, and have completed and turned in a few assignments through this platform. Please, if you can, take a few minutes and log into The Hub go to our class and complete the very short questionnaire. Don't forget to hit submit at the end. Those of you who complete it will have obviously seen my message here and have been able to access the internet on a device of your choice. If you forget your password, please email me and I will reset it. Those people who do not complete the short task in the hub in the next few days will receive a phone call from me simply to find out what their situation is. Nothing's being marked right now. No assignments are mandatory right now. We're all just figuring things out, day by day. Please do not allow yourself to be stressed out about this. Slow down, be well, one day at a time. The Ontario government has signaled that schools will not reopen for April the 6th, but nobody can realistically do anything other than guess what day we'll be back in. Between now and April 6th, we are just establishing what things will look like going forward after that date. Between now and then, as we collect information and establish what we can and cannot realistically do, more information will become available. We don't have the answers to everything either, and even if we did, they'd probably change between now and next week anyways. In the meantime, please complete the short questionnaire and look forward to more information coming your way as it becomes available. Also in the meantime, don't stress. We'll make this easy. Check out some of the resources on the ministry website and some of the resources that the board has provided. You'll find links to these directly under this video. Stay well. Read a book or two. Consider keeping a journal, even in Google Docs. Play Prodigy. Play an instrument. Explore your community together with your family, remembering proper social distancing. Canada's chief medical officer confirmed that this was still okay as of just the other day. As spring continues to set in, look for flowers, tree buds, bugs, spiders. The snakes will be coming out soon. Crocuses, tulips, and snowdrops are already coming up. The earth is waking up again, and we have the chance to explore it. Wash your hands. Spend quality time with your loved ones. Slow down. Be well. Bye for now.